Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is a little different and also a really fun one. So I'm gonna show you guys three of my favorite snacks. I've been eating many of these things for years. I love them. They're just like the easy go-to snacks I do when I don't have a lot of time. I wanna have something pretty healthy that I know is gonna make me feel good um, and will literally take me two seconds to make. So whether I'm like momming for the day or working or whatever I'm doing, these are some go-to snacks. Um, let me know if you guys want part two of this. Snack number one, fruit and tahini. I typically like to do this with watermelon or mango and grapes, but there's a little trick for the grapes. So I will show you guys. I'm addicted to this, especially in the summer. So, good. so here's my fruit. I usually just get pre-cut watermelon, but if I want to make like a lot of this and Kinsley's here, I'll get the whole watermelon, cut it up, but I usually like to make it about this big. And then I'll take grapes. I prefer green typically, but I'll half them. You can also do this with mango and experiment with other fruits too, but these are kind of my go-tos plus mango. So then I squeeze a little bit of the lemon right on the grapes. Um, I don't really do it on the watermelon. I feel like they're sweet enough as it is, but I like adding a little bit of that tart to the um, grapes. And then I'll take the tahini. Here it is. And I just give a generous sprinkle. This is also really good on cocktails and margaritas and all that on the rim. But I just do this and then enjoy. Number two, look how pretty this bowl is. I just got these new bowls from Anthro, so I'll link them below for you guys. But there's a couple of different iterations of this. I like to switch it up a little. But essentially, it's this little like veggies, cheese, salad. I top it a very certain way, and it is delicious. So here's how I make it. I need a bite. Satisfying. So I cut up cucumbers, some heart of palms, and tomatoes for this one. I usually actually do avocados, but I just don't have them right now. But if I did, I would typically do avocados. Sometimes I do um, onions, really anything like that. So here's a little heart of palms, tomatoes. I just go with tomatoes as long as they're small, whichever ones look good. And then major key, make sure you get mini cucumbers. Those are the best. They are the crispiest. And then, sorry, I just hit the camera. I go for this feta. And also this is great with mozzarella. So I, there's a couple different iterations that you can make of this, but it's always delicious nonetheless. And then I will take a little bit of balsamic and olive oil. There's already salt on this and just drizzle it over the top. Perfect. So refreshing and delicious. Last but not least, and definitely the easiest, I like to call these little like turkey and cheese tacos, basically. But again, there's a tip here. Gotta get the special turkey a very certain way. I like pickles on the side. So good, especially if you want like something high in protein that will fill you up. That's quick and easy. I love making these little like cheese and turkey, I guess they're almost like little taco, like roll up things. I don't know what you would call them. Sometimes I put the pickles in if they're the thinner, like little round sliced ones. Sometimes I put on the side. This little combo is everything, especially if I'm kind of ditching bread or whatever it may be. This is healthy, quick, energizing. It's so good. So I do the turkey and I always get it shaved. Don't at me about this. You have to get it shaved. Just trust me and try it. It's 20 times better. I've been doing this since I was little because that's just how my mom got it, and I love it like that. So I personally do the Boar's Head Maple Glazed Honey, and I get it shaved under a one, and then this is provolone. These pickles, you guys, are everything. I found these at Target, and I have been in love with them. They're so flavorful. So these are three of my favorite snacks that are very quick and easy to make and healthy, but I have a bunch more. So let me know if you guys want to see a part two of this video um, in the comments below, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.